Hey everyone, welcome to day 100 of my 25 push-ups a day. 100 days, pretty cool. Boosh! Two and a half thousand push-ups later, and I'm here on day 100. I've still got 265 days to go. Anyway. So, how did it all start? It started back on the 9th of July. 2020 when I was nominated for the 25 uh, push-ups for 25 day challenge for PTSD um, so I took on the challenge as I said 9th of July was my first day I did my 25 push-ups was quite a struggle and uh, after about three or four days uh, I was pretty stiff sore and uh, I thought to myself, I need to make them a bit more interesting. So I started to put some Lego pieces around me, sort of a crowd to cheer me on. I started wearing different hats. And then I started incorporating sort of themes and uh, making the videos more exciting, which, which seemed to uh, go quite well with everyone on Facebook where I was posting them. Uh, I reached the 25 days and I decided to myself, you know, I'm enjoying this, it's exercise, it's keeping me busy and active and creative. And I thought, well, why not carry it on? So I thought I'd do that, which I did. And I was thinking, oh, let me get to maybe 100 days. And I thought, okay, I'll do 100 days. And then I thought, uh, after looking online at quite a few people doing, you know, 200 push-ups a day for 30 days and uh, 100 push-ups a day. And I thought, well, okay. I can do that. I can do that. Here I am, 100 days in, and I'm, my goal is to reach 365 days. I'm recording every single day, as you can see from my channel, and uh, I will continue doing that every day. Some days will be funny, silly videos, some will be variations of push-ups or other exercises, some will be workouts, and others might just be the straight push-ups. So, a mixed bag of videos for you guys. Um, some of you might be asking about uh, transformation in 100 days and what that meant for me. Now, I've always struggled with my weight. And uh, going into this, I wasn't uh, very active at the time because of lockdown and gyms closing and that. I do enjoy my gym. I do, I do enjoy sports. Um, so, yeah, so this was uh, something to get me up and moving again. And... Uh, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed doing active things and uh, running around or lifting weights and stuff like that. Yeah, so so the good side of the transformation, I uh, I didn't really track myself from the beginning because that wasn't the intention in the first place. But uh, as I started doing the push-ups, I did notice obviously my strength and endurance increase and 25 push-ups became quite easy for me. Uh, that's when I started putting in some variations and more difficult types of push-ups. Uh, I started doing some challenges, how many I can do in 60 seconds and things like that. So um, that was good. So the strength gaining and endurance was good. Uh, weight wise, I did sort of lose weight and gain weight. But I guess that's probably from the muscle mass that uh, I picked up from doing so many push-ups. I didn't just do 25 push-ups every day. I did more on, most, on quite a few days in order to, to try and achieve uh, different things and, uh, you know, push myself further um, and uh, yeah so th those were mainly the good things and it's a bit of a physique change I haven't like again I haven't got any pictures so I wouldn't be able to show you any but I have noticed my arms looking a bit better in my chest and then the bad side of uh, the hundred days of push-ups <clears throat> putting me putting my body through 25 push-ups a day plus more and other exercises does take it does take its toll and I picked up a shoulder injury and I've had that shoulder injury now for probably two months and it's not going away it's not getting any better I've gone for treatment I'm doing loads of different stretches and exercises but it just doesn't seem to be healing so I am unable to do any more challenges or train for any uh, any challenges I am just doing my 25 push-ups a day but I have to break them up into sets of maybe five or less because if I do any more, it starts to hurt and I just don't want to risk a further injury where I can't do any. And my other arm isn't strong enough for me to do one arm push-ups and 25 of them for the rest of the 265 days. So, 
I am going to continue and I would like to say thank you to everybody who has supported me. I appreciate all the comments, <clears throat> all the suggestions, all the motivation. That's what's kept me going. I really do enjoy seeing people enjoying my videos, whether they're silly or not. Um, I hope them being silly uh, entertains you and you do enjoy them. Um, <clears throat> and I do hope the variation ones and the more serious ones also entertain you. Um, and on this 100 day journey so far, I have met some really cool people, some fellow YouTubers who are very inspirational, very motivated and driven, and uh, they have nothing bad to say. They are always encouraging people to get up and do some exercise. And uh, I take my hat off to you guys. You are the ones that, uh, you know, help guys like me sort of carry on and do what we want to do and keep us going. So thank you to all of you. You know who you are and uh, keep supporting me. Uh, I've got 265 days left. Um, I'm watching your channels for inspiration and motivation. So uh, I'll be around commenting as well. But yeah, just thanks everyone for the support and I really appreciate it. And uh, I hope to see you guys continue and I hope to gather more supporters on this journey. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys at day 200 for another summary. What I've done is I've put together a video of a hundred different exercises that I've done in the hundred days. It also includes some of my silly outfits or wigs or hats that I've been wearing, um, variations of push-ups, exercises, stretches, whatever that is. But there's a hundred of them within the video. So that just sort of summarizes my hundred days of push-ups. So thanks again. I hope you enjoy the video and I will see you guys tomorrow for day 101. Cheers.